Good morning. Welcome to. Um, oh, oh, they're stopping. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's so great. Uh, my neighbors have decided that it's uh, these are the days to really do some home improvement projects, and uh, they've been having the the air blow, the water blower pressure thing going all morning. <laughs> That's the kind of noise I was looking for in the morning. But now they're done. How exciting. Wow. I'm just a happy, much happier man now. Uh, hey, pages 907 and 908 uh, is your homework for today. And it's literally called My Homework. Um, poly, polygon. Polygons we're doing today. Um, polygons like this uh, toy here for this puzzle we have. I'm supposed to put it back in the box. Uh, can I put it back? I know. I, I, I was like, I'm going to impress my students. Put it right back in the box. That's not happening. That's not happening. Maybe later. Maybe by the time I get the answers. But even then, I don't know. Coffee. Practice. Practice, practice, practice. Name each polygon. Determine if it appears to be regular or not regular. Regular or not regular. What is regular? Regular means that all the sides are the same. A square is always regular. Every side is the same. Every angle is the same. They all meet each other. Um, this, these are both quadrilaterals. This one is not regular because it's got this side. These sides are shorter than these sides. And this angle is smaller than this angle. So, look at those. Two, two polygons right there. Which one are all the same? Um, and you're going to... Same. What's the word we use for same? And in, when we're talking about uh, polygons. Congruent. Congruent. Nice word. Um, you really, literally never use it other than in uh, math class uh, when you're in school. And then as soon as you leave school, they suck it out of your brain. And you go, what? Congruent? Why don't I just use the word same? Congruent. Uh, a polygon, uh, fill in the book. Vocabulary check. A polygon is a blank figure made up of line segments that do not cross each other. Well, I'm guessing that what they're asking for, because I don't have the answers. Don't think I have the answers in my book. I don't have the answers. If I were a student, I would write something like a two-dimensional figure. And yet the space they give is so small, who knows what they could be asking for? Uh, a regular polygon is a polygon with blank sides and blank angles. Well, regular, they're all the same. But what's that nice word that they want us to use? Use it now before it gets sucked out of your head. Use it now. For exercises five through seven, use the tan gram pieces shown at the right. Which of the polygons appear to be regular? Really, there's only one that's regular in all of that tan gram. Oh, it gives me answer. It gives me the answer to how to put it all together. Wah ha 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 ha. Let's see if this works. Which of the appear to be regular? I see one that's obviously regular. It's the one that I just showed you, actually, to say, this is regular. Um, so, which poly what polygons are represented in the tan grams? All right, so there, um, there are, I can see two different kinds of polygons in there. What are the two different kinds? Defining, define them by how many uh, sides they have. There's really only two different kinds of of um, uh, uh, polygons in there. Hold on. I just want to show you how good I am. I was able to put this all together without looking at the answer that was right in front of me in the book. Hello. That's how. That's a genius. Um, number seven. Congruent figures have the same size and shape. Which polygons appear to be congruent? Oh, okay. So, which <clears throat> are there two uh, of the polygons that are the same? Are they congruent figures? Are the whole thing's the same? Um, 
it's pretty easy when you look at it. What two, there's how many in here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's seven different shapes in here. There are two that are exactly the same. Oh, I wonder which two they could be. Uh, number eight, name the polygons used to form the front and sides of the tent shown. Determine if they appear to be regular or not regular. Well, I can see two different kinds of shapes. I can actually see more. There's two different kinds of shapes. Um, yeah, whatever. Uh, name, name the two polygons. Um, how, how are they stuck together? I'm not going to ask you to. Yeah, don't worry about it. Uh, number nine, justify conclusions. Hector states that the figure to the right is a polygon that is not regular. Do you agree with Hector? Explain. I think Hector should drink a little bit more coffee. I think there's something that that figure has that is not, uh, not a polygon at all. What is it that that figure has that makes it not a polygon? Gosh darn it, Hector. Hector, Hector. Number 10, text practice. Which of the following figures is a polygon? Well, what's a polygon? It's a polygon. Polygon's got straight sides. It's got enclosed space. And it's three or more sides. That's a really good idea. You could have, yeah. So, there's only one of them. It's not regular, that's for sure. All right, that's it for your homework today. Super easy homework today. Uh, if you got one of these, like, lying around the house, a tangram, apparently. Apparently, this is what this is called. I had no idea. Tangram. Uh, play with that. That's your homework. Play with shapes. All right, have a good day. Bye.